Then I see a figure from the other side hiding below the, like, the teacher's desk. So I stare, stare, stare. Then I realise it's <laughs> So then she pee, 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 right? Then she had to disturb me. Because there's a gap <gasps> between, right? So as she go down, then she saw a pair of feet. But the socks went all the way out, like never ending, yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> Alright guys, so before we start the episode, we must give a massive shout out to our sponsors, Chris Plus. If you want to travel more or just collect more miles, this one is for you. Chris Plus is Singapore's Airlines Rewards app. And this October, they're having a crazy birthday batch. You confirm want to check this out. That's right. So here's the thing. Chris Plus lets you earn more miles when you pay with the app at their partner merchants. And the best part, you can earn those miles on top of your usual credit card rewards. So double show. <laughs> Wait, wait, so I use my mouse credit card to pay through Chris Plus, I will get extra mouse from Chris Plus? That's right, so you double rewards just spending like you normally do. So if you want to jump for more mouse, Chris Plus is the way to go. For those who don't know, mm. this mouse earned on Chris Plus, what can you do with them? Hey, it's super worth it. You can use the mouse for like free flights, even upgrade your seats on SIA or Scoot. You can even use your mouse for hotels, shopping, dining, all sorts of things. So the more you earn, the faster you can fly. Okay, I'm sold. So what's happening with this birthday bash in October? Okay, listen up, okay? So from 1st October to 31st October, here's what you can do with Chris Plus, okay? So over 40 partners are giving you 10 miles per dollar spent. No one else is doing this, okay? Other credit cards give you 1 to 4 miles per dollar only. Then with just 100 miles, right, you stand a chance to win even more, which are enough to redeem a pair of Singapore Airlines flights as far as Europe every week to win us. Lastly, they also got birthday deals at popular merchants, so you save money and earn miles at the same time. Wait, did you just say 10 miles per dollar? Mm -hmm. That's them power. You can really rack up your miles just by going about your day. Exactly, and you don't need to change anything. Just use Chris Plus when you makan, shop, and you'll be stacking miles like crazy. And on top of that, got chance to win free flights every week. Mm -hmm. Hey, this one, I confirm going for it. Hey, same. So if you haven't signed up yet for Chris Plus, now's the time. The birthday bash in October is the perfect chance to start collecting more miles and maybe even win some free tickets. Thanks again to Chris Plus for sponsoring today's episode. Go download the app and start earning those miles now! My poly had a damn f***ed up thing that the seniors did. Yeah. We did a night walk, right? It's always and then, night walks. It's always night walks. Hey, what poly? What poly? Say ah! Uh. Singapore <laughs> poly or Singapore poly? <laughs> Ooh, it's always Singapore poly. I won't say the club though. So, hey, what, what club? <laughs> skate club ah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 skate yeah, club yeah, for yeah, one yeah. day. She just asked me. <laughs> Why am I so far coming with the information? It seems like the more rubber one. Yeah, they mm. damn rubber. So there were a lot of stations throughout the night walk. So you will walk in through the dark school and then go to this classroom, go to this classroom. So one of the stations was uh, the toilet. It and is the, the U-shaped toilet. It's the U-shaped toilet. So Singapore Poly has these like U-shaped toilets. There's two uh -huh. doors. There will be seniors who will be standing outside to kind of greet you. Like, it's like, so then welcome. give you the instructions. Like, yeah, yeah, welcome. Okay. <laughs> and the whole <laughs> toilet is pitch black. You need to go in you need to light this candle mm. and then say Bloody Mary three times. <gasps> no, that's so dangerous. Yeah. Yeah. I would have gone home. I'll describe the toilet is very scary because it's a, in a literal U. Yeah. So there's like a blind spot when you reach oh. the bend. You cannot see the other side because mm. it's a very narrow U mm. at the end. That's why it's like very scary. So no choice. La. You know, you go in and then it's pitch black. You take a lighter and then you light. Sorry, how many people in group? Two. Two. <laughs> Okay, I'm out of here. Two per group. Two is too so much. So you go in and then, hey, so I go two. in right, and then I light the candle and then I'm like, bloody Mary, bloody Mary. It and don't then, say uh, BM, 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 BM. Then there's a senior in the one of the cubicles, dressed up as a ghost, and then you can see her in the reflection, then she'll scream. Oh, like, my, oh god. my god. So that's the intended. That, that's at least then you actually. Then light the candle <laughs> <laughs> So that's the intended like station. La. Suddenly there was an announcement like during the night walk, is that a girl went into this U-shaped toilet, she did the Bloody Mary thing, and when the seniors screamed, she ran out of the toilet. But the two seniors outside the toilet didn't see her. Cannot find her. <gasps> they say we didn't see her leave. And Wait, but who saw her leave? The, the other partner. She, the other partner says she's missing. Oh, she's gone. So and she didn't senior, even come out of the toilet. Yeah, like she just disappeared. Call everyone back. We we you know cancel this night walk already. Let's split up. Go find her. Let's split up. Uh. As in that, of course. <laughs> as in everyone go around, try to find her, like you know, go to the usual areas, and then everyone start getting concerned, like, oh, this is not night walk anymore, and, uh, and screaming her name, all that kind of stuff. And then, uh, and then cannot find her. It's fake. We come back, she's sitting there, she's a senior, yeah. I knew it. I but everyone was pissed after that. Eh. Of it's course like there was a like, genuine concern for this girl. Uh. 
Who Wait, her just watch, sitting uh? there is a horrible punchline. If you want to do it, you follow through. Huh? So then okay. you say, never mind, we, we, we cannot find her, but we still want the night to continue. So <laughs> it's okay. Then what? when you re- re-enter, now you continue entering this U-shaped toilet, right? Then that senior <laughs> is dressed up as the ghost version of her uh, to scare the next one already. Uh, that one got kicked. No, but that one... Uh, that one real hard. I think I will die. die. Oh, wow, that's so I, rubbed, though. I quit skate club. <laughs> For me, right, they just they never make us go in the toilet. They say it's like cannot, cannot go in. This is like restricted. I say not restricted, ah. la, but, but go at your own wish, right? They right next to the toilet door, then they explain you see the bottom? Then the toilet door, right, at the bottom is like broken. They say, you know, they have to have this hole, you know why? Someone was stuck inside, they never come out. <laughs> They just keep going, the you, the you, the you. That's why you see this door, the wooden is rotting. We to help them see the light, we have to let the light in. <laughs> no, I was f- scared, no? No, I think it's bullshit. Uh. <laughs> 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 they 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 go inside, inside yeah, there's yeah, two yeah. doors of like the rotting wood and I believed it a bit, I right? Because that's the only two doors, right, with the rotting wood, like, that is actually cut. Because all the normal toilet doors are full length, ma. Right. But only mm. that U-shaped toilet, right, is like half, if it's like half and it is rotting, like, Someone try to patch it back. I can't believe you believed them after they said they were going in circles in the U shape. I like, should believe. Can I escape? Can I escape? Play <laughs> safe. Cannot, cannot, cannot like it's supposed to be a U. But then if they cannot escape. That's the horror part. Like they enter the U by the O. Oh. This happened in one of Singapore's most haunted places. St. John Island. Ooh. Okay. Ah. It happened when she was in primary 5 going for her P5 camp. I'm not sure if any of you all been to St. John Island. But St. John Island in the middle, this meeting area, right? There's this cage looking thing. Like, you know, mm-hmm. at the soccer field, right? Those, that, that chain looking thing, that wire. To climb one. In the way. soccer field? You know, like generally soccer field, there's this wire thing that Corrode the people inside. What are you is talking this? about? Are you describing a fence? A fence? <laughs> oh my Jesus! Okay, sorry. Let me repeat this. Okay. No, okay. no, 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 no. They stay in the car. I keep picturing a soccer field is empty, right? Only the two goals. Indoor kind of football field, is yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. oh. It's like those futsal indoor futsal. futsal. Yes, it's like futsal. Oh, the cage, ah. The cage. That's why I've been saying cage. So one night, right, we were all gathered inside this cage thing. Just nice, right, there was a thunderstorm, so they couldn't get out. Broom! So imagine, uh, thunderstorm very, very loud. And it's so loud, right, they cannot hear each other. Outside the fence, right, there is like, you know, during camps, right, you all draw on a big canvas, like white colour canvas, cloth. My God, flag, my flag. Ah, the flag, the flag. <laughs> right. The the basic no, words. broom, one thunderstorm, right. Suddenly all, of them, all the papers, right, managed to cover up the entire cage. Oh, quite cool. Like, just ah. <laughs> envelope the entire thing like that. What? And cover it. Then it was dark. Uh. There's no light in the cage, so they cannot see anything. They're like, oh my God, oh my God. Then the minute it totally closed, they heard, all heard a loud scream. Remember I told you just now, they cannot hear anything because of thunderstorm. Yeah. So the loud scream was so loud, right? Everybody was like, oh my God, do we leave someone out outside? Oh, then the, they the start, scream came from outside? They came from outside. And then everyone started doing head count. Everybody, right, look down and then like put your hand right in front of your, uh, your friend's shoulders. So everyone's looked down and then they all started chanting. Huh? Like the OGLs, I don't know what, they like, apparently they know uh, what to do, what to say. And I asked my colleague, what are they chanting? Are they praying or what? They said, don't know. They just like, it's not English. It's not, it's just gibberish. So they it's don't understand. Okay, so anyways, oh. so I thought it was tongues, but then I asked her, she said she didn't know. <laughs> Fast forward to at night. Okay, it's still at night, uh, but then like the rain uh, subsided. Su- subsided, right? And then they all went back to sleep, but they couldn't sleep uh, because whatever happened, right? So then our colleague and four other friends, right? They all combined three beds together. In order for someone to come in, right? They will have to go through all the other beds to get to them. They were all facing each other, but all the girls like, ah, cannot sleep. So okay. people kids have conversation. Ah. Yeah, that's <laughs> what I meant. That's, 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 that's how they sound like that. Like, I, I don't, because I couldn't, cannot interpret what they are trying to say. You don't know girls. Be I fine. really don't. We, we, yeah. The rest of us understood that. Yeah. Okay, so we'll right. They were talking halfway, they're looking at each other halfway, right? suddenly one girl was pulled down. Huh? What the like, f- Like, pulled down, like, so when she's lying on the bed, right, she doesn't just bend down. Like, that's what I'm talking, 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 then everyone like, okay, we should we acknowledge that she got pulled or <laughs> she what? She disappeared. Yeah, then, no, she put down, but she yes, was there. Acknowledge. So then she had to wiggle back up. They continue con- having conversation, right? Then the second friend got pulled down. Another girl. Another girl in the same group. Then they're like, oh my they god. Want for more. I, I, yeah. Yeah. I want to be pulled next. down also. Then they keep thinking like, could it be someone prank? But no one could have gotten into the room. Uh, at one point, right, they heard the no OJs outside the room, the window there, right, and they started chanting there also. Like kind of like praying slash chanting. I'm not sure what they're doing. Yeah. So that was. 
the experience that my our colleague shared. Wait, and Ever no, since then, nobody no, reacted. Nobody reacted because they were so scared. They don't know what to do. Like they scared to look down and yeah, see. Yeah, they scared to look down. So it's like someone's tugging you and you just ignore it like that. Like, like, yeah, like, yeah, they just like, pick up like, 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 If you get pulled by your leg, not to look at what is pulling your leg. No, but that's what the ghosts want you to do. They want you to pull and yeah. then you're like, you yeah. must see me. But anyways, it was so serious, right? That the parents were all notified the day after. <gasps> and then all everybody there in the camera had to go for counseling. <gasps> wow, the counselor. Oh. Suddenly so got 40 kids. Business. Yeah. <laughs> I paid a basic salary. And how does that make you feel? I don't understand why every school camp, right? Need to do night walk, yeah, uh, horror that? night, what? Yeah. Courage challenge. Uh. What is the because oh, when, OG, I'll tell us. Uh, oh, yeah, for God. He's not not me, not because I do it, but I think it's because they can now when they were juniors. And then now that they are seniors, Ball, they want right. to people through the same thing. It's true tradition. It's because they Fear need to bonds. sacrifice one person every cohort, no? Oh yeah, that too. What well, happened oh. in your cohort? Wait, what? What's this? I'm never, I'm never hearing. I've never heard like, of this Usually before. every night walk, right? You will hear of one person getting injured or something happening to them, right? It's because that person was the sacrifice no. in some way. No, man. No, I think the creepy thing is that because you are also playing, how is it? The night walk is just, it's not just a normal night walk, right? There are certain versions where the OGLs will be hiding in the rooms and then they will be scaring you also. Mm. That's me. Oh, what? In secondary school. I was a leader of like this peer leader group. So we had to organize a camp. I hate horror stuff, okay? Like I hate horror movies. I like was still away from all this night walk thing. But then I think because I lead her, I try to organize like a night walk, but a safe one, like just three rooms and like don't, no spiritual shit, just like, we just act like zombies and ghosts. Lah. Then I don't know, for some reason, right? I go put myself in a damn vulnerable position. So I, I put myself in the first room, which is like a music room. <gasps> then like, I feel like the music room, right? Got a lot of like instances for ghosts to come scare me. Like yeah, the got piano. a freaking piano. <gasps> then got a lot oh of cupboard God. with like very old like instruments inside. And then I don't know why, right? I decided to just put myself inside with a random like uh, assistant. So just us two in a quiet aircon room. In a big room, right, with full of mirror. Then you scare yourself. <laughs> <laughs> now I sit at the corner. Then somehow, right, I even give myself, okay, I can be like zombie, ma. But I think that time zombie not popular, so I decided to be Pontiana. So I had like a white dress. <laughs> I'm sitting at the corner of the piano, like everyone will walk towards the piano, the most inside one. So I can see my safety assistant, but people cannot see. But then I see a a figure from the other side hiding below the, like, the teacher's, there's a teacher's, you know, desk oh in the God. front. Then I alone, ma, then it's like mirrors. And then the only, because we patch up the thing, the only, so we patch up the thing and the only light is from like, the moonlight from outside, like in the window. Firstly, I'm just like, I have some ghost. Later they think I have a friend. <laughs> then I like, I keep telling my, it's like, he like, stupid, stupid, like, don't I reply me for some reason. Then I like, my life, what is that thing? Then somehow I like a bit shangkwang. So like, <laughs> not in the dark. Stick. That means oh. like in the dark, my eyesight is not good. You know when you stare at something that it will like focus. So I mm. stare, stare, then I realise it's my f- reflection. I knew it! I'm like, f- <laughs> la, like, what the hell? The thing, Myopia. The thing no, is really to like, squint. No, I really like choose because I see a exact same figure in white. Wearing a white like, dress. Like, but Long dark hair. figure at the corner of like the, the area. But then I realise it's like, I don't know the refraction or something, right? That made me think is. You know ghost. what? You what will be freaky, right? Nah? If like you look at, right, then no then your reflection will be you. <laughs> ah. I would die. I quit school that right there. But then after that, I was like more confident on myself. Like okay, there's no ghost. So I I did a great acting. You did a great. <laughs> I, did a great I was like. <laughs> But they don't teach English at school. <laughs> <laughs> she in the music room. <laughs> I got a few screams. Mm. Nice. Side question, a uh, quick one. Would you rather have Kena that kind of night walk experience or what I experienced in uni is actual ghosts <laughs> <one> in the <laughs> world? They pour fish oil down your eyes. What? <laughs> There is a particular camp. What camp? What camp? So it's a hazing. Uh, no, it's it's a, oh, yeah, yeah. That's the word. Oh, you already know what? what? I feel like that's what camps are. It's all camp, like. It's all camp. I thought it's all camp. Oh, number three. Hall 12. Hall 11. No, but you just say what hall we censor. Hall 15. Hall 15. 15. Don't cancel on censor. 15. We say it throughout, so very hard for the editor. Things 15. Among the many things, it was. Uh, pouring fish oil down your head, which will eventually go down into your eyes. Can't you just close? You know, you close already, but it still stinks like shit. Oh, uh, 
you go into a kiddie pool, you know, the kind of circular inflatable ones, mm -hmm. the inside is just a whole gunk of mess of like, like rubbish. What? Yeah, and then they'll put a what half cut watermelon on your head. Wait, isn't there another <laughs> YouTube channel in Singapore? <laughs> <laughs> they'll get he one of the this camp. <laughs> he went to the they'll camp. get one of the buffer guys to take you by your legs and then swing you in a circle, like a giant swing. <laughs> if you all watch WWE. <laughs> <laughs> he must be so he's just, he's just, he's just <laughs> What's the purpose of this camp? What's the angle? Bonding, uh, bonding. We don't know, well, survivor. Was, <laughs> survivor. Survivor. So survivor. So you walk camp. in the pool of rubbish with a watermelon head and then somehow you meet a man who will swing you. No, then, then you're taken <laughs> to the next station and then they blindfold you. Okay. And then, okay last. Then one of the seniors will just take your hand and then walk you to the first station. Then you start feeling liquid for now. You're, oh, so you're blindfolded yeah. almost the entire time? The whole time. Huh? Oh, so what's then this how bonding? You know how, it, how, how do we bond? What happened? Huh? Cause you can feel it, it's happening to him. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, so you're blindfolded and then you walk halfway and then suddenly you feel then, your then, feet then, being picked up and then, then you're like, like Okay, okay, stay here, stay here, okay? Stay here, don't move ah. Huh? Wait, they do this to guys and girls? Yeah. <gasps> I think only the guys would gonna the giant swing line because I don't think the girls would. No, like if they swing you, but then what's that? Like how show to, you? No, how huh? to stop? No, like, how, yeah, to, how stop. to stop? If you watch wrestling, you know, like, he just stops his momentum a bit. Then, <laughs> then you land safely. Then all the freshies who have gone through this, like just take out the blindfold and then they're like, what the f was that? And then there's a shed bond. It's like, oh, crazy. What's Trauma what bonding, fuck? it Trauma seems. Trauma bonding, literally. <laughs> all 15. <laughs> 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 no, every hall have like that one. Uh. You know, what was that? What was that? And like, hey, you did it, man. You know, you, you, you're one of us. <laughs> oh my God. All 50. <laughs> <laughs> no, every hall have like that one. It's not exclusive. What? What is, is this even? No, yeah. some are even worse. Mm, yeah, sports yeah. camp. Sports no, but, yeah, yeah, but what is this? But you know what's even? the worst part? You pay eh, for these camps. No, but you get a t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> The you in but like the t-shirt that I wore was completely ruined. Yeah. No, you mean stained with memories. Uh. No, I threw away stained with memories. I got so much so poetic. solidified flour. <laughs> <laughs> it's disgusting. <laughs> Lucky Alison never go to this camp with motion sickness. Yeah. Our, yeah. Actually, I... I or every time they blindfold me during night walk, right? I purposely put right yeah, just yeah. nice right at my eye here. So when I look down, I can see where I'm going. So I don't feel as scared. But actually, right, when they see her, she like... Speaking of looking at the floor, I have a story. Ooh. Ooh. Is the mochi thing? No. Oh, okay. No, mochi. mochi is they bring you to the beach, then they make you all go get wet. Then after you must come, they roll in the sand, so you're a mochi. Yeah, the neighbor died. But it's just them gross. Then it's all inside, like your underwear, or like all sand. Or then Some, bonding. Sometimes the, they take the giant stick and stab you. <laughs> oh, sometimes the guys stand. It's a NDU thing, wa. I saw hey, our boys do men tree. Or NDU. Yeah. They no, have to do the flying, you know, the arrows. <laughs> uh -huh. Like they go in the water Flutter already, kick. then they like, go on, no, send now. The flying kicks, then they do the kicking, the app thing while they use the, the pedal and throw sand on them while they're doing. No, oh, but that's, that's this so kind dangerous. of thing actually can happen to them though. Like they are running in and out of the beach, ma. so that's useful. This one is that what? makes more sense. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, sometimes soldiers need to flutter kick on the beach. Yeah, then they have sand. sand. Going. on them while they are doing <laughs> sand <laughs> flutter kick. No, maybe you're running, running, yeah, got harder. some explosion or what? Uh, more seconds, <laughs> keep pushing. <laughs> the enemy comes. Why you're so nice on army? It's more like uh, <laughs> no, because you're trying to say that it's realistic, right? Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, the <laughs> kick faster, kick faster! The, the enemy is coming, flutter, kick faster! <laughs> the 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 enemy, oh my god, they're doing the flutter kick! <laughs> 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 Onto your back, you said that they can also comment flutter kicks! <laughs> <laughs> then they're doing it back to each other. <laughs> the Chloe thing appear. <laughs> oh, Chloe thing. <laughs> My cousin actually shared this story with me quite a while ago. So oh. she was also at OGL for one of the night walks mm. in her secondary school. Mm -hmm. And there were already stories of the school being haunted, especially certain classrooms. Beforehand, there's like this ritual with like peppers or like some capsicum that you need to buy. Then you have to go to every classroom to pray then you have to like stick this thing, like this skewer thing in the corner. So then it's like saying that, oh, we're gonna borrow this space and I like, don't disturb us, that kind of thing. Oh, okay. So Spicy. then after that, this specific room that people like get very spooked out at. And then after that, everybody just thought that, oh, maybe like that room, they planned something very scary. They hide like some OGL inside. Mm. Then after that, towards the end, like when people were started talking about it, right? Then everyone was talking about this specific classroom. And then after that, the OGLs were like, eh? like that's not one of our designated classrooms. So how can everybody go inside, right? And then like everybody is scared by something inside. Then the story that people were telling is that there was a person that was stationed at level four that like direct them to this classroom. To this classroom. Mm -hmm. yeah. Who's so this then, person? 
don't know. <sighs> so then they were like, hey, but I mean, if there's uh, somebody that is there then in the school uniform, then they just... <gasps> Oh my oh, god! Sorry, I missed that out. They were, as in like the PE uniform, that kind. So okay. then, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so then what goes in the PE uniform? So direct them right? to this classroom. After they go in, then they will see like there's this thing that like running like in the corridor, <laughs> like long hair that kind of shit. Then it's like running past, running past. Then everyone's like, what the heck? Then nobody there to go out of the classroom. Not everybody stuck in the classroom. Then everyone will just like stay there. Then they wait for the thing to pass already. Oh. Then they faster like go out. Then they follow back their glow stick and go up oh to the fifth god. floor. So was the end of the night. Then they were supposed to like check that they clear out all the skewers because like, it's food ma. when they went into this set classroom so like one of the OGL said that they went in right then when they bent down to pick up the skewer then they bent down then there was a pair of feet oh, oh no pick the skewer and step the foot <laughs> ow <laughs> but, but this then how you acknowledge the feet mm. oh, you accidentally you just like then you feel ignored no, but that made me damn scared. Like sometimes when I'm alone in the office, right? Like, you know, I'm last to leave. Then I go and go and take the trash that time, right? Then I then, like, I always like try not to only let my vision be down. You know what I mean? Mm. <laughs> Those so I look down and like, it's like, like some tie. foot or whatever. So then. in Decathlon, they sell these spectacles, right? <laughs> it's like point up one so that when you're helping people to belay when they're oh. Oh. You're looking upwards, right? You look a bit stupid, but... But your neck doesn't hurt it's because you're No, there's also the kind where you look yeah, down. So if you, you are knitting, you don't need to look down. Have we got on the oh ceiling? Oh my god. Oh. No, the stupid thing is that if you do that, you cannot look straight. <laughs> you're only looking. <laughs> so just close your eyes. You know, in primary school, right, you go to school very early, ma, like 6 a.m., right? The sky is still dark on. No? So early. Yeah. I go to okay, mm. I yes, was yes, in the morning session. Dark, yes. Then normally my friend and I, right, a group of us, right, we will go to the toilet. So then in my primary school, right, uh, I got this friend, right? Only both of us were early that day, and then she say she wanna go to the toilet. Then I said, okay. But I think I didn't follow her because she thought I followed her. Hmm? Then she okay, she thought I followed her, so she went to the toilet, right? The whole time, right, she thought I was with her. Eh. Oh, as if she told you and then she just went yeah, thinking that correct. you were behind her. Okay. Yeah, correct. That she thought that I was going to follow up. She went, right? Then she when I saw her, because I was in the hall waiting for her. Then when she came back, right, she started crying. I think next few days, the rest of the week, she didn't come to school. Huh? She started crying. Then I saw what happened. Then she tell me that. So she went into the cubicle. She went to pee. Ma. So she heard another. The cubicle on her right, right, also closed the door. So she assumed it's me la, this whole time, right? So then she pee, 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 right? Then she like, disturbed me. So she was like, like at the cause there's a gap <gasps> between right, then she like eh 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 you know like she like just disturbing me right so then, at, then she, I wasn't responsive, so she bent down to see, oh. so as she go down then she saw a pair of feet then she don't recognize the shoes because she knows my mm. shoes ma it's like another you know ballerina shoe that kind of white color one so it was so white right the socks also very white but then right the socks you keep looking up to see. Is it me? But the socks went all the way out, like never ending. Huh? Like it's ridiculously long already. Like, uh, like it's not, um, it's not, you know, it's, not a sock. it's clearly ah. not a sock. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> then, then she like, she calling me, is it me? Is it, she saying, oh, Shemin, Shemin, Shemin. Then she like, I never, she like, I never respond. Ma. Wow, then she f- open the door, wash her hair, then run already. Yeah, oh, but she still wash her hair. <laughs> <laughs> I remember, I don't know. The statistic is that right. Singaporean men don't wash their hair when they go yeah, to the toilet. Yeah, yeah. That is crazy. I, yeah, die, I cannot stand all these toilet things. I feel like right in any other situation, it, in a situation where I can just immediately run, still okay. But toilet, right? What, my pants down, ah. bathing. Oh my god, they got me. Still can run, <laughs> <laughs> but then there are more people that will get traumatized. <laughs> <laughs> what makes you think there are people? Mm. So do you all announce your <laughs> presence in the toilet? Why like the some, heck would I? No. Again with this one. <laughs> 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 then then you throw the around the in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> then I mess up the other <laughs> toilet <laughs> cubicle. I throw the toilet paper around. Uh, you no. flush every. Oh, I, I open all the doors. <laughs> <laughs> He is announcing your presence, what? No, but sometimes no sound. Then okay, some people pang you know. Yes. Then I scared they. <laughs> so I then they very quiet, ma. Only sometimes you hear bloop bloop, you know. I always say the toilet paper plum 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 plum. Then I flush first. Then I will like make a lot of noise so that people know that I'm in around. Oh, wow, that's annoying. Eh. If I'm the next speaker, I'll be like. Shh. <laughs> you watching your show? <laughs> <laughs> no, then I appreciate that. Okay, the person is real. There's, there's someone next mm. door. No, no, me and a girl had a noise battle before. Because <laughs> normally, okay, normally when you shit, it's very awkward. Because you want to make the least amount of sound possible. So like, you will time your action like pulling the toilet paper or flushing with the actual shit. Or coughing. So like, let's say your shit is about to go down into the toilet bowl, right? It will make a f- sound. Ma. So you do, you want to prevent that sound. So as it goes down, right, you faster pull the mm. toilet paper. Oh. Or like, start to flush. Then I was shitting like my ass off. Like, like <laughs> stop it here, ma. I know. Hands pressed. <laughs> 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 I got a lot of sound. I never, 
I never do much. I just like, ah, la, la. Then suddenly, another girl come in, I like, fuck, like, I still got some load. Then I like, I cannot, I cannot totally like let off because I don't want to let her know I'm shitting. So I hold it first. I hold very long. Like, I don't make any noise first. In case she a quick one. So that she can pee and go like, like mm, do my own then business. You release, then I realized yeah. she take them long or so. Then I was here like. <laughs> 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 then okay, she does. <laughs> but never go out yet. <laughs> Oh my god, she's shitting also. And she's trying to like make her noise also to like prevent the shit sound. <laughs> then I also let her know that I shitting so I, I like okay, la, let it rip. Then I, why? Then she also <laughs> <laughs> I legit finish it. I flush it. Then I start to make the, my back the sound like, <laughs> like you know, like. Yeah, you gotta go. That's a whole like stop production. I try to like make the door move a bit, like, then I go out. Then I go out. Then I go Wash your hand and I tell. So men, right, are the complete opposite. Eh. Huh? Huh? They want to high five. Is it? I, I feel like I want to do that because I pie say a bit. With my experiences in public toilet, in male public toilet, right? I mean, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I can't, I can't hand, but I go in, I will hear them, right? Just like. Then they're Everything, eh, you hear every sound. so audible. It's to the point where they are poop, poop, poop. Then you. I can almost picture the shape ah. of the shit and then the gas and then what else is going through right? and it's so rabak right and then I want to laugh because it sounds so funny <laughs> but I have to tahan this all the time but there was one time where I you know, I hear it blah 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 right? then I <laughs> I burst out laughing then he laughed back <laughs> I say, but so, then I'm like, oh, I'm sweating because I also need to shit. Um, then, but then I just cannot. I'll have to let him finish it. Yeah, then I can go. Like, I hear him leave oh, the toilet. Then I go. Oh, I thought you wait for him outside his cubicle. Yeah. What? Well, yeah. <laughs> 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 Thank you for the, the performance. <laughs> That's yeah, 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 yeah. Next time. <laughs> the kind that I respect and I wish I could pull off, right, is the 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 lid touch release. So huh? <laughs> there are times where I'm already in the cubicle, okay, and I hear a man. And I hope it's a man. But I hear a man enter the next cubicle. The door closed. I hear a zoot. Then I the, I hear straight away, I hear BOOM! Like, true. <laughs> the moment the butt cheek touch the bowl, and they yeah. don't even, like, I, every time I go in, I have to clean the toilet bowl properly, uh, everything yeah, yeah, yeah. prepared. Slowly take off pants. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is just, clo- the door closed only, right? You hear the pants drop, you hear the belt hit the floor. Then, the moment their butt touch the bowl, right? Then the shit just, they Fly really out, tahan very long Let it rip. The and shit already custom already. And it's like, <laughs> so just, <laughs> yeah. I don't hear the clunk clunk of the toilet yeah, roll. Yeah. Somehow they just like. And the worst part, right? No, it's no. No, The fact that he also knows this proof that it is a pattern. And then he That is the real horror of today's episode. I'm genuinely horrified. Disgusting. It's the coughing for me. So we've come to the end of the episode. John Paul has rushed off. You see his chest pin. He's going to sit on another chair to do a lit touch release. So we will see you in the next one. You can leave your personal stories, whether it's like your school camera horror stories or your toilet horrors down in the comments down in the comment section below. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Like, share, subscribe. Wash your hands. Yes, yeah. Please. I was at the boogie's toilet, the upstairs one, like the most ulu one. Mm-hmm. Uh. Then suddenly I hear something like, like when I enter, right, like there was only three cubicles. So the middle one was taken up. So I just go to, to another one. Uh. Then when I I was peeing, then suddenly I hear like, like, like that. Exactly that. And like, like that. Like little, little like Wind. laughter. Little oh. moaning. Oh, that was like, I was like, what, what, who is that? Like I never hear, cause normally you will hear like some tissue sound mm. or some like- Toilet ASMR. Like, like, you know, the, the phone sounds or whatever. Then I think like, like, then I just peek, right? I, as in, cause the, okay, the, the boogie's toilet, right? The below, the gap, a bit high. So it's not like I peeping top all the way down. Uh. It's like, I just like that. To see the to shoes. To see the shoe. Then I saw, right? Two pairs of feet. Oh. oh, oh! so they're having sex last year was in the same direction. Eh? A doggy uh, style. Oh, I was like, like uh, that. I was like <laughs> opposite cowgirl. <laughs> <laughs> now I faster flush and run. I knew it was moaning. I think I uh, you're right. <laughs>